On the phone from uh, uh, Wall Street uh, is uh, Justin Weeds. He is uh, from the New York City General Assembly. Justin, what is the New York General Assembly? The New York City General Assembly, and I'm sorry if my voice is a little hoarse. It's been quite a day. I can imagine. Um, is a, yes. The New York City General Assembly is a group of people, a growing group of uh, people who have committed to a consensus-driven process of finding solutions, of making decisions, and taking action around issues that are critical to, to our social justice and to our well-being in New York City. And uh, are you guys, what's happening down there now? Where are you located and, um, and, w and what's happening? Are people, uh, 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 are, are you guys uh, staying there overnight? Have you been there overnight? How long have you been there? That's right. This is our third day of the occupation. Uh, we are located in Zuccotti Park, uh, which we are going to re-rename Liberty Plaza, its original name. Um, and we have encamped now for two nights. We're on to our third day in this park and we have no intention of leaving, and our intentions are to meet peacefully, to assemble, to, to exercise our First Amendment free speech rights, and our right to peacefully assemble in order to address these issues and tackle these conversations, the difficult conversations that we need to take and to have in order to begin to make some real actionable decisions and begin to state some really clear demands about what we need to see change in our culture. How many people uh, are there and how many people have been there over the course of the weekend? So the numbers have you know, fluctuated from day to day, but only in the sense that many people have come in solidarity during the day um, and then join us again the next day. But each night we've had at least several hundred people here sleeping. Um, and during the days we usually swell in size. Uh, at this point there are quite, quite a large number of people here in the plaza. Um, and part of that is sparked by the fact that just a few minutes ago, there was an arrest of a young girl who was uh, chalking on our encampment. She was writing in chalk. She was arrested by the NYPD. Arrested for writing in chalk? That's right. Just a few minutes ago. And so people here are peacefully assembling um, in protest of that arrest, as well as several other arrests that occurred this morning during our peaceful march to Wall Street. Arrests that include um, arrests for wearing masks in the street, um, as well as arrests for disorderly conduct, where we have video showing that there was not at all any violence or disorderly conduct. And, and but we're very well documenting everything here. And tell me, uh, just give me a sense of what, I mean, what, what is the, the fundamental uh, principle? Why Wall Street as opposed to anywhere else? Why Wall Street? Um, well, Wall Street is symbolic of so many things for, uh, for New Yorkers and for you know, people all over the world. Uh, it really represents, for many of us, uh, the symbol of a huge industrial collapse. Uh, the, the collapse of an entire you know, financial sector that nearly brought on you know, economic collapse. And after a bailout you know, of hundreds of billions of dollars of our tax term, uh, we're stuck here with uh, neighbors being foreclosed out of their homes. Students like the ones that are occupying here with me um, so entrenched in debt that they, it'll take them 20 years if they ever get out of it. And, uh, and just a general you know, climate of uh, jobs and an economic climate that is not working for us and our political leaders aren't making it any better. And, uh, and, and let me ask you, um, is it, there, there have been reports that, there, uh, that the uh, police are making arrests of anyone wearing uh, masks outside the park. Uh, can you confirm uh, that? I'm sorry, say it again? Uh, we've heard reports that the police are making arrests of anyone wearing uh, the anonymous masks outside the park. Uh, can you confirm that? Um, at, a certain, at this very moment, I can't confirm those arrests are being made. I have um, heard reports and believe they've been confirmed that at least one or two arrests were made this morning for people wearing masks in public because apparently uh, there is a New York City law that states that no more than one person can wear a mask in public. And uh, let me ask you this, how many, um, how many uh, media outlets have been uh, interviewed at this, at this point? Have you, are, are there, are there uh, reporters from uh, the various TV and radio outlets and uh, print? Absolutely. I mean, at this at this moment, I see at least 
uh, three or four different mainstream media outlets. We've seen Fox, CNN, ABC, New York One, Channel 7, PIX11, um, many, many independent media. Um, and we, we ourselves are, are uh, sending our information out through our own independent media center, which we've set up in the center of the park. And so we are, we are ourselves documenting very, 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 very closely uh, and in intricate detail everything that's happening here. And we encourage all New Yorkers to come out and to bear witness to what is happening here so that we can hold the police to account, so that we can watch them very closely, and so that they know, and we all know, that the world is really watching what's happening here in Scotty. And, and finally, my understanding is, is, is that a private park uh, that you guys are occupying? That's right. This is a private, uh, what, I guess what's called a private public space. And has, the, owned public space. And has the owner been supportive? Uh, according to my understanding, the owner has given, had, had given the okay to the NYPD um, to allow us to stay on the stage as long as we were not disruptive and loud in the evening with amplified sound, as long as we were peaceful, uh, which we have been throughout. Great. And where can people get more information uh, from uh, what's happening in the uh, New York City General Assembly, as you're calling it? Right. So you can visit our website at OccupyWallStreet.org. Uh, you can also follow us. Uh, Call recording off. A minute uh, at, through Twitter on the hashtag uh, Occupy Wall Street, Take Wall Street, Step 17, um, and through my own Twitter feed, uh, Occupy Wall S T N Y C. Occupy Wall S T N Y C. All right. Well, thank you very much, uh, uh, Justin Weeds of the. Uh, now established New York City General Assembly um, uh, in, uh, in downtown uh, New York, uh, just around the corner from Wall Street. I appreciate your time.